With the release of Beyond Light back in November, we were given an introduction to one of, if not the dumbest men in the entirety of the Destiny lore as it stands today. The irony in all this was that he was supposedly the smartest man in all of Destiny's golden age. Clovis Bray, the man who wanted to become immortal by either becoming the alpha genome of a future descendant or through obtaining immortality himself, this man was destroyed by his own ego. During the golden age of the 21st century, Clovis Bray came into contact with the darkness. With no hesitation and a singular promise from said darkness, he pushed forward into creating the EXO program. With no thought about what the repercussions of what would slash could happen to himself or his lineage, Clovis Bray fooled himself into thinking that the darkness was the only there as a tool and it that it didn't have its own agenda. With that, Clovis unleashed hell upon the Destiny universe. Clovis Bray's releasing of the Vex into Destiny's universe was the first of many horrors to arrive before the Traveler could come to our aid and protect us from the darkness, and still to this day plague several people. This can be seen from both Banshee44's memory loss to Elsa Bray's push towards defending the Vex Gate on Europa and helping the Guardian with the Black Heart during D1. Clovis Bray was manipulated and fooled by the darkness that even during his near-death experience where he was mutilated severely by surgery equipment that the Vex made a defective copy of Maya Sundaresh reprogram that he berated the Traveler for not stepping in and dealing with it instead of fully realizing own hubris that was his downfall. Even now in the present day, where the Guardians have come across the Clovis Bray AI, does Clovis still think he has done nothing wrong? Because to him, seeing Elsa and Annie still living are his own works and accomplishments. He has yet to realize that it was the Traveler that was the one to truly correct his work, and it was the Traveler to provide the immortality he sought after in the first place. That which was given to others, and is a gift he will probably never achieve himself. Clovis Bray was a blind, egotistical man that through his own delusions of grandeur thought he was untouchable and even in death to this day still thinks he is a god. And I believe even he was fully shown just how badly he screwed up, he would never learn his faults. This is proving that Clovis Bray is indeed the dumbest man in all of Destiny. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls of all galaxies, my name is Tech Stomper, coming at you from Tech Industries, and honestly, I kind of, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, um, this is just something I wanted to do, because Clovis Bray just makes me so fucking mad, like, it's, it's, it's ir irrationally mad, <laughs> just the way he, like, talks, or the way he is, and everything, and I kind of got the idea from a YouTube, a YouTuber that I watched for Skyrim lore. And this, um, he used to make like shit like why, why Yarrow Bogriff is an idiot. And I didn't really see that on Destiny 2. And a lot of people just talk about the lore and they don't, they don't come up with their own opinions most times. They just read the lore and then tell you and that's how that is. Um, but I really wanted to make like a why, why some people are idiots. And I figured the best person to do it on is fucking Clovis Bray because he's the dumbest person I can think of in the Destiny 2 lore. So I hope you, again, I hope you guys enjoyed. And as always, this has been Tech Stomper. Sign off of Tech Industries. Do you and goodbye.